Hi everyone, in my first ever YouTube video, I'm going to unbox, set up, and demonstrate Lumo, the Segway robot for you. When you're not riding it like a normal Segway, you can have it follow you around and take pictures of you until you're ready to ride it again. My three-year-old daughter helps out along the way and adds a little humor to the whole process. So be sure to watch the whole thing because I think there's some really funny moments in there. Check it out. Not like that. Come back here. Stand right here. <laughs> Parker, <laughs> come, come stand here. Smile. Hi, my name is Troy. It's finally arrived. Hi, my name is Parker. It's finally arrived. <laughs> uh, I'm going to do an unboxing of Lumo, the Segway robot, with my little helper. You ready to get started? Yeah. Okay, go get the scissors. Here. I can't read. Don't get the scissors. Looks like it traveled pretty well. Straps are all intact. A little bit of damage in the corner here. Can you throw these away? Yes. Put that in the trash. What, Daddy? Please read carefully. So they have instructions on how to open it. Segway Robotics. This may very well be the unboxing video that kicks off the robot revolution. Somebody's anxious to play with the robot. They can't even wait. See, I told you, the future is coming. Sit right here. The future is coming. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> All right, come over here. Oh, I see the robot right now. On this side, more battery warnings. I turn around. Yep, I gotta turn it around. This is the side we open. You can put the box over here if you're gonna play with it. Seriously, Parker, this is gonna take forever. So the idea with this robot is it was built by Segway or Ninebot, the company that owns Segway now. And it's not like one of the hoverboards or the other knockoffs that you have to worry about catching fire or uh, falling off of. As you can see, the box that was inside the outer box is in really good shape. Um, so far, no shipping issues detected. All right, here we go. Now the fun begins. Up. Quick start guide inside the inner box. See? Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, look, it's black. Hey. Stay over there, don't walk in front of the camera. <laughs> What's that? Circle. Circle. What are these? Circles. Buttons. I guess you can wear a button and uh, join the robot revolution. Okay, you want that one? All right, give it to mommy. She'll put it on. Can I have that envelope, please? Thanks. And here we have. Hello there. Thank you for finding our robot a new home. You are one of the first owners of Lumo. Order number 81. I got it. Let's see. Look at it. Oh, yeah. Cool. You're so cool. Okay. Why do we have one wheel? The first truly mobile personal robot that can accompany you everywhere you go. We'll continue to develop you, Lumo and unlock new capabilities and features that will wow you. Okay. If you have any questions or feedback, that's all it is. It's a letter. It's not even a book or anything like that. And then the strapped inside looks like 
user's manual about that thick. So the unboxing instructions actually say to grab the handle and lift it out of the box. But I'm realizing it's only on two wheels, so if I lift it out of the box and just let it go, it's gonna fall over. So I'm looking at the uh, quick start guide to try to figure out how to uh, turn it on as soon as I get it out of the box. It's pretty heavy and it's in neutral. So it's rolling around. Ah, there's the handle right there. Couldn't see it with the plastic on. That's how you lift it up. The power button is on the front right here, but I've got it kind of secured by this handle on the back. And now it's time to turn the power button on. That's it. It's balancing on its own right now. So there's something in this box right here. I didn't see the charging cable. Yep, massive brick. So this is everything that came in the box. Uh, welcome letter, buttons, I'm not sure what purpose those serve other than for you to show your Lumo pride. Uh, user's manual and I believe the warranty information uh, or legal statement. Charger, charging cable. This looks like it might be to fill the tires. So made a few beeps and blips there. I'm noticing that the battery is only about half charged right now. I'm gonna pick up the camera and give you a cruise around so you can take a look at it, but you'll notice it's moving a little bit back and forth, keeping balance on its own. So the wheels are lit up on the side. Give you a close view there of the battery. And you can kind of see there, it's, it's just keeping balance all by itself. It's standing there, if you will. All right, so let's go to the quick start guide and see what's next. I'm trying to be extra careful with this because I know there were some over the air updates that might need to take place uh, last minute to make sure that this is uh, going to be safe. Step one, power on. Two, transform. Three, set up the network. Uh, download the Lumo app. Some safety you notes know, for powering off. Push the power button, then set it down carefully. Yeah, they don't exactly tell you how to set it down. No, I'm, I'm kind of busy right now. What is that? <laughs> Just, you know, unboxing my Lumo. I thought you were building a robot. No. I said you ordered a robot. Oh, yeah. That's much quicker. I'm going to add on to this one, though. Oh. Whoa. 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 <laughs> so What's he all mad about? I don't know. He doesn't like that. <laughs> anyway, I got to go. I got to finish this real quick, and then I can call you back. Hi. Hi. He's not a robot yet. You have to trans make him transform. There you go. Set up the Wi Fi network. All right, so now it's time to download the Lumo app. Okay, I got the Lumo app and I have to enter some more information now. So after I get my information added in, it's asking me to connect. So I'm not able to find anything, uh, any robots in the app. It's telling me to uh, click next on the device. So hopefully after I do that, maybe it'll see the robot. Sure enough, that was the trick. So if you're not seeing your robot on the app, go click next on the robot and then it will show up on the app. Bye. Successfully connected. And of course, what I was expecting, a system update is required. So I could say later, but I'm gonna go ahead and update it. Saying a restart is required, updated voice commands and interaction approach, uh, updated follow shot. So I'm gonna go ahead and do it. 419 megabytes. It's downloading pretty fast. So it's saying, okay, I'm ready. Oh, I have to hold the handle while I update. So that was just the download of the update. Now the actual update might actually cause it to lose its balance. 
Please lay Lumo down gently on the ground. And there's an illustration here showing you how to lay it down. Basically, it's saying to lay it down like this and push done. Good night, Lumo. Happy updating. You need to unlock the voice skill first. Yeah, on the screen there, it's saying it's installing Segway and then a version of the firmware code. In the middle of updating, it transformed back into Segway mode and it continues to pop and click. I'm not sure that it's still updating or not because the screen is facing downward. But I'm going to try to catch a glimpse here. And sure enough, it says it's still installing the update. And even though it switched its head, I can still see it's updating on the screen down there. So obviously, this is not the most user-friendly update experience. There are things happening on the screen, but I can't see what's going on because the screen is hidden. <laughs> I promise I love the robot. I need a drink. Me too. Okay, 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 okay. Shutting. Whoa, whoa. Can you buy me one? Still going. Huh. I think he might finally be ready. All right, I'm gonna give it one more power down and power on just to make sure it's done updating and fully updated. I think it's ready. So that's pretty cool. I'm gonna pick the camera up and just i going to give you a real quick first impression. So after I transform into robot mode, you can see it picks me up already. It's following me around the room. Just zoom out and see, walk around and see what it's doing. Follow me the other way. You looking for me? So it's really cool. It's like just doing some weird things. It's like it has a personality all of its own. Yeah, you do. What are you looking for, buddy? What are you looking for? Let's try to get it to do something. Okay, Lumo. You need to unlock the voice skill first. It says, you need to unlock voice skill first. Okay, Lumo. You need to unlock the voice skill first. Hi there, my name is Lumo, and I have been waiting a long time to meet you. I know you must be thinking. So you are a robot. Great. How do I interact with you? Let me walk you through the steps one by one, so that you can get to know me better. You can touch my face. See, I am a very cute and friendly robot. I have two touch pads on both sides. These are my home buttons. Check the back of my head carefully. Do you see a button in the line? Yes. If you place the palm of your hand on the line, you should hear a beep sound. That means I'm in pushing mode. My handle is on my back. If you want to carry me around, you should only use the handle. Now let me show you how to give me voice command. Say OK, Lumo. OK, Lumo. Great. I cannot hear your requests unless you wake me up with OK, Lumo. Try to say take a photo. Take a photo. At your service. Wow. You look sharp. Hold on. Let me try to find a good angle. Three, two, one. Cheese. Perfect. You have learned how to give me a voice command. I've saved your photo. You can check it on your phone after this tutorial. Yay. I love this part. I can transform into a scooter. I will show you how to ride step by step. At the back of my head there is a transformation button. Press it and I will transform into a scooter. Can you press my transfer? Good job. I am so excited to teach you how to ride. Let's get started. Now please step on the board from the back. 
If you don't have time right now, you can simply press stand straight, keep your legs loose, and keep balance for five seconds. You got it. Turn left or right by pushing my head with your knees. Try turning in a circle on the spot. Fantastic. You got it now. Shift your weight forward and I will take you forward. Keep going for 10 feet. Great. Congratulations. You have finished the writing guidance. You will get better at writing with practice. Okay, Lumo. All right, it looks like at some point I I got voice control activated. I'm not sure if I was if it was something I was doing with the app, but anyway, just a, a really quick demonstration. Okay, Lumo. Let's go. And it's basically ready for me to ride it, unless I say, okay, Lumo. So it's pretty neat. Now it's listening to me, and it's going to kind of give me some cues as to what I can do here. And uh, so these are all going to be topics of future videos. Okay, Lumo. Let's go. Let's go. Now what it did there was it actually used its sensors to detect where I was and then came over to me and then transformed so I could ride it. I'll ride it over here and do another demo. Okay, Lumo. Now we're back to robot mode. So if I just walk over here, for example, and it's watching me, I can say, Okay, Lumo. Let's go. And I can write it again. Okay, Lumo. Follow me. Pedestrians, pedestrians. <laughs> okay, Lumo. Let's go. Lumo cam. Ooh, too fast for indoors, I suppose. So I hope you enjoyed my Lumo Segway robot unboxing video. And if you did, please click on the like button. And if you'd like to see future videos uh, involving my robot, please click on the subscribe button and uh, turn on alerts. Also, if you have any questions about the unboxing or Lumo in general, put those in the comments area. And um, also in the comments area, let me know if there's anything you would like me to demonstrate on future videos for you. So I'm just super excited to make these videos and explore all of the possibilities with Lumo. I just have a ton of uh, future videos planned, everything from a full tour of all of the sensors and different features of Lumo, a full review, app development, hardware add-on development. So if you wanna see those videos as I release them, definitely uh, click the subscribe button and turn on alerts. And I look forward to making future videos for all of you and uh, interacting with all of you in the comments.